U.S. Navy aircraft carriers are an engineering marvel, capable of launching and recovering dozens of aircraft in a matter of minutes. However, the complexity of these operations also means that accidents can happen, often with devastating consequences. From collisions at sea to onboard fires and explosions, these accidents have claimed many lives and caused extensive damage to the ships themselves. In this video, we'll take a look at some of the worst accidents that have occurred on U.S. Navy aircraft carriers in history. Before we begin, I want you to stay on top in the knowledge game of Navy and aircraft updates. And to do that, just click on subscribe and press the bell icon right now, and I welcome you to the world of Navy. USS Forrestal Fire, 1967 Picture this. It's July 29, 1967, and the USS Forrestal is cruising in the Gulf of Tonkin off the coast of Vietnam. The ship is gearing up for a mission to launch its planes on a bombing mission when suddenly, chaos erupts. A rocket, fired accidentally from one of the planes on the flight deck, strikes an armed A-4 Skyhawk aircraft, causing an enormous explosion that ignites a deadly chain reaction. The raging fire burns for hours, and it takes several days to finally extinguish it. The aftermath was devastating, with 134 brave sailors losing their lives and over 160 others injured. The USS Forrestal was left with extensive damage and had no choice but to return to the United States for repairs. This incident also had a significant impact on the U.S. Navy's operations in Vietnam, as it reduced the number of available aircraft carriers. USS Nimitz Collision, 1981 Now, let's fast forward to May 26, 1981. The USS Nimitz is out at sea, conducting training exercises off the coast of California. Suddenly, out of nowhere, the ship collides with another aircraft carrier, the USS Kitty Hawk. It's a terrifying and confusing moment, and sadly, it's one that will go down in history. Miscommunication between the two ship's crews is to blame for this catastrophic collision, which resulted in damage to the USS Nimitz's port side and the tragic loss of 14 brave sailors. Another 48 sailors were injured, and the entire incident sparked a significant review of the U.S. Navy's communications procedures. It also leads to a complete overhaul of the way aircraft carriers operate when they're in close proximity to one another. USS John F. Kennedy Explosion, 1988 Now let's dive into another tragic incident that occurred on the USS John F. Kennedy in 1988. It was April 14th of that year and the aircraft carrier was in the middle of a routine training exercise. Suddenly, disaster strikes. A missile stored on the flight deck malfunctions, causing a massive explosion that ignites a raging fire. The USS John F. Kennedy is left with severe damage, and the lives of its crew are in grave danger. One brave sailor lost their lives in the incident, while another 11 were injured. It's a gut-wrenching reminder of the dangers of working on an aircraft carrier and the importance of safety protocols in such high-risk environments. This incident sparked a thorough review of the U.S. Navy's missile storage procedures, leading to strengthened safety protocols that aim to prevent similar accidents from happening again in the future. USS Enterprise Fire, 2010 Last, but not least, we have the USS Enterprise Fire, which took place on May 14th, 2010, in the middle of the Arabian Sea. It's a typical day on the aircraft carrier, with crew members working diligently to complete their tasks. Suddenly, out of nowhere, a fire breaks out in the engine room, and chaos ensues. The fire spreads quickly, fueled by flammable materials stored nearby. It's a dangerous situation, and the USS Enterprise is at risk of being completely destroyed. Luckily, the brave crew members are able to contain the fire and prevent any fatalities. However, the aircraft carrier suffered extensive damage, and several sailors were injured. It's a reminder that even with the most rigorous safety protocols in place, accidents can still happen. Despite the setback, the USS Enterprise is able to undergo repairs and continue with its operations, thanks to the hard work and dedication of its crew members. Lessons Learned and Future Improvements It is important to remember 
that every incident is an opportunity for growth and improvement. The U.S. Navy takes these incidents very seriously and conducts thorough investigations to determine what went wrong and what can be done to prevent it from happening again. Through these reviews and changes, the U.S. Navy has become more prepared and better equipped to handle any potential accidents that may arise in the future. It's a testament to the bravery and dedication of the men and women who serve in the U.S. Navy that they are willing to put themselves in harm's way to protect our country. So, let us remember the lessons learned from these tragic incidents and continue to strive for the highest levels of safety and preparedness in all military operations. Comment down how you think these incidents could have been prevented and what precautions could be taken for the future. We would love to hear your thoughts. After all, these accidents are lessons for the whole world. And not only that, they pave the path for further innovations in aircraft carriers to avoid such incidents in future. And you know how safe the latest next generation aircraft carriers in the world are in 2023? Do you know about some of the largest aircraft carriers right now? Well, to know more about that, you need to click on this video right here. These are the world's largest aircraft carriers in 2023. So what are you doing? Click it now and I will see you there.